Hello, in this video, I'm going to walk you through this amazing new request testimonials tool. It allows you to automatically collect testimonials from your clients uh, to automatically distribute it on your website and on social media like Facebook and Google, which will just automatically uh, enhance your credibility online. So such an amazing tool. Uh, let's get into it. So once you're in your dashboard, you're going to click on the testimonials uh, menu here. Uh, once you're here, you're going to be on the main testimonials page. You're going to click on the orange request testimonials button. And first step is to create a, a form. So you can create one or multiple forms. Uh, you can customize the forms depending on maybe create one for buyers or sellers or just a general one for all clients. So in this case, I already created one. I'm just going to uh, click edit uh, and it's the same as if you click uh, creating new form. So uh, the first thing is the form name. So I just called this testimonials request uh, the header of the form. So would love to get your feedback and then some text underneath. Uh, I'll show you how this looks right after. But, you know, your feedback and comments help me improve my level of service. Leave a review of your recent experience and get a five dollar Starbucks gift card. So, you know, whatever you want to put, maybe something enticing there. Um, to, for clients to leave a review. Uh, you can customize the, the color of the rating stars. We have that at yellow and the form field. So here you can customize the uh, forms, uh, fields of the form. So what you want to request from your client. So um, ask for a title, description, profile photo. So I'm just gonna leave these two for now. So just the description, just the testimonial mandatory. And then if they want, they can also leave a photo. But you also have the option for uh, you know, asking for photos, videos, attachments, etc. And scrolling down, suggest clients to post on social media. So this is the key point here. You should always, you should probably always have this selected to yes, especially if you you have Facebook and Google or Zillow pages already. So this will just uh, suggest to your clients to also leave a review on your social accounts. And again, I'll show you how this all connects, but. Uh, very simply, you know, if you want to add your Facebook, just add your Facebook URL. Again, Zillow. If you have a Google account, just start typing in your your company name. This connects to Google Business Pages, so you would have to have a Google Business page. So I'll collect that, or I'll add that and add. There you go. So in this case, I'm just going to do Facebook and Google. Uh, scrolling down. So this is great too. So you, now you can auto approve. So if this is selected as yes, so now if, if someone rates you a five stars only or four stars or greater, but I'm just going to leave it to five stars only. So if someone leaves you a five star review, this would auto approve it and automatically publish it on your website, which is uh, very great. So that reduces a lot of the manual work on your end. And uh, finally, the rating feedback settings. So uh, this is just a little comment after someone leaves a review. So if someone leaves a uh, four or five stars, you're going to say, you know, something like this, which you can edit. So thank you so much. Really appreciate uh, your feedback. Uh, and if they leave uh, three stars or less, you can put some text there as well. So thank you for your feedback. Your comments will help me improve my level of service. So I'm going to click save now. And show you what this looks like now. So after you create the form, you're going to see a copy URL. So now if I just open up a new tab and paste this URL, this is what that form we just created looks like. So again, here's the form. We'd love to get your feedback, that text, the form itself, uh, they leave a review, enter the testimonial and submit. So let's just fill this out as a quick test here. So John Jones. Let's quickly. All right. John's going to leave a five star review. Amazing service. Thank you so much. Highly recommend using Costa as your realtor. So now, if I click submit, perfect. Thank you so much. Really appreciate your feedback. Here's a review. And, you know, thank you for your feedback. Please take a moment and share your review on the following site. So, so this is where we're suggesting, encouraging 
your clients to also leave a review on your Facebook and Google. So if they click Google, for example, it'll prompt them directly onto your uh, Google page to leave a review. So uh, just like that. And again, if they click Facebook, it'll also prompt them right to your page so they can easily leave a review. So, so that's how the form works. Now, couple of things, how to actually practice on a, in a practical sense, how to use the form. So two main ways. So one is directly on your website, obviously. So we can take this form a uh, great place to have it is for example, on the testimonials page. So like this is my, my test site here. So, so a couple of things you'll notice actually right off the bat, you can see I created or I just submitted that form from John Jones. You can see because it was a five star, it's automatically on my website right here. Uh, so that's the first thing. And second, you can actually uh, embed that form directly on your website on a testimonials page. So you would just have this on your website at all times, uh, direct people to it. Sometimes people will find it and just leave a review. And, and that's great to have directly on your website as well. Now, one of the, the beautiful ways, the automated ways to really put this on autopilot is to use it with smart mail. So I'll show you how to do that. So on your dashboard and you click smart mail, um, I already have a campaign set up here, but I'll create a new one just from scratch to walk you through that. So, so in essence, uh, I'm going to create a campaign in this case, and I'll, I'll walk you right through it, but it's going to be an automated campaign that automatically sends an email to your clients after their closing date, asking them for a review. So simple as that. So I'm going to click here. I'm going to just go all contacts next. I'm going to call the campaign, uh, requesting testimonials. All right, here, I'm just going to use one of the save templates I have here, which is basic text, text based template. So, I just had some text already saved here, but okay. So this is what the email is going to be. So it's like, Hey, first name, this is a dynamic, uh, text will automatically put the, uh, person's first name here. Uh, I would love to get your feedback and hear how your experience was working with me. Feedback from amazing clients like yourself or what helped me continue to improve. Click the link below to leave a review. So, to, to get that link, very simply, we have, there's a links button right up here and you can actually copy that testimonials request or that testimonial form we just created. So I'm going to paste that in. It's going to look like that. Uh, email subject would love your feedback. Okay. Now if you click next. This is where you would set up the dynamicness of the campaign. So if I'm going to click send it on a contact CRM date, uh, this is where it gets really cool. So I'm going to click after, so it's a 15 days after closing date. So this email is going to automatically be sent 15 days after a closing date. So anyone in your CRM that has a closing date, 15 days after that date, they're going to automatically get this email. It's going to be on autopilot. You don't have to think about it. And, and that's literally it. So, you know, in the email will look something like this. So it's like, Hey, uh, Hey Sandy, we'd love to get your feedback. Here's the link. It's dynamically there. When they click it, they'll be prompted to that form. They're going to leave you a review. Uh, they're going to submit it. It's going to automatically go to your website and they're going to be prompted to uh, post it on your Google and Facebook, which again, just enhances your credibility online. We know how important it is to uh, have reviews online. That's really impactful and influential for a buyer's decision making. So such an amazing tool this is. Um, I hope this helps. And as always, let me know if you have any questions. Thanks.